Hello everyone, and welcome to Quantify's presentation on the basics of calculating and estimating brickwork. In this presentation, we will discuss and work through examples of cost analyses for mortar and brick walls. Be sure to watch our other brickwork presentations for further information on brickwork takeoffs and various terminology. The final section to cover in our brickwork series is allocating a cost to the previous calculations, that is, a cost analysis for competitive tendering. Please refer to previous presentations for information used in the slides that follow. Once the final quantity of brick work has been calculated, a cost analysis can now be compiled. This cost, multiplied by the final square meter quantity, will provide us with a total cost for the brick work required. To tender accurately, contact your local suppliers for current rates and substitute your local currency into the analysis. For this exercise, let's use the South African Rand and assume the following. Cost of stock bricks, at 2,000 Rand per 1,000 bricks. Cost of face bricks, at 6,000 Rand per 1,000. Cement pockets, at 80 Rand per pocket. Sand, at 160 Rand per cubic meter. Shrinkage on mortar materials, at 30%. Wire ties, at 30 Rand per bundle of 100. Cost of a brick layer, for a 9-hour workday, at 720 Rand per day, which includes for 1 hour's paid lunch. Cost of a general laborer, for a 9-hour workday, at 405 Rand per day, which include for one hour's paid lunch. We calculated the cost of one cubic meter of mortar at 1265.76 Rand in the brickwork presentation on the cost of mortar, which we can carry through into our brickwork cost analysis. To price our brickwork, let's assume our labor team is made up of two brick layers, assisted by three general laborers. For pricing purposes, we can reduce the team to one brick layer, that is, divide the team by two, and therefore have one brick layer, assisted by, one and a half general laborers. This team can place an estimated 640 bricks, in a cavity brick wall, built in a stretcher bond, per day. To work out a labor constant for our brick work, we can apply the following formula. Total time, divided by, total output. Therefore, in our example, this will be, 8 hours of work per day, divided by, open bracket, 640 bricks divided by, 104 bricks per square meter, close bracket. The labor constant is equal to, 1.30 hours per square meter. Using the output of 640 bricks per day, and the quantity of various bonds and wall thicknesses, we can calculate the following labor constants, using the labor constant formula of, total time, divided by, total output. Brick on edge header course, at 8 hours worked per day, divided by open bracket, 640 bricks per day, divided by 12 bricks per meter, close bracket, equals 0.15 hours per meter. Continuing with the same calculation for other types of brickwork, we can determine the following. A half brick wall equals 0.65 hours per square meter. One brick and cavity walls amount to 1.3 hours per square meter. A one and a half brick wall, 1.95 hours per square meter. And finally, mass brickwork takes 5.34 hours per cubic meter. We are now equipped to use the above information and assumptions to accurately price a square meter of brick work. Let's assume the following. Unit of measure, square meters. Brick application waste, 2.5%. Mortar application waste, 20%. Add 5 minutes per square meter, so, 5 minutes divided by 60 minutes per hour, equals 0.08 hours per square meter, for cleaning of cavities as the wall is built to the laborer's rate. Add 5% to the total labor rate for forming open perpens, to perform the above item, and return to close, once the wall is complete. Using the layout for a cost analysis, with columns for resources, unit of measure, quantity, rate and amount, we can now calculate the cost of a square meter of brickwork. Stock bricks for a cavity wall of, 104 bricks per square meter, times 2000 rand per thousand, which equals 208 rand per square meter. Application waste of 2.5%. Mortar of 0.035 cubic meters per square meter, multiplied by 1,265 rand and 76 cents. Application waste on mortar of 20%. 5 wire ties per square meter. The labor constant for an artisan is, 1.3 hours. We use the same labor constant for the general laborer, add the 0.08 square meters for cleaning cavities, multiplied by 1.5 laborers. Lastly, we add 5% to the total cost for labor for forming and closing perpens. The total cost for a square meter of brickwork is therefore 474 Rand and 87 cents per square meter. 
The final section we will run through is, extra over for face brick work. If the external wall has been specified to be built from face bricks, we need to add the cost of the face brick and additional labor to neatly place the facing bricks. As this wall has already been measured, and a cost allocated to it, we will need to deduct the cost of the external stock brick skin only. The additional cost to be added to items that have already to some extent been measured, is referred to as, extra over. The cost of face bricks is 6,000 rand, less 2,000 rand for stock bricks, therefore the extra over cost is, 4,000 rand per thousand bricks. Brick application waste on face bricks is 2.5%. Face brick output is 416 bricks per day, that is. Total time, 8 hours divided by. Total output, 416 bricks per day, divided by 52 bricks per square meter, which equals, 1 hour per square meter, less the labor constant for stock bricks. As we are deducting only one skin from the stock brick wall, we deduct half the labor constant, that is, 1.3 hours, divided by 2 for one skin, equals, 0.65 hours per square meter. Therefore the extra over cost, is an additional 0.35 hours per square meter for facing bricks. We can add an additional 0.26 hours per square meter, for pointing and joining bricks, to the artisan's rate, the assumed calculation being, 8 hours, divided by open bracket, 1,600 bricks, divided by 52 bricks per square meter, close bracket. Moving on to the face brick cost analysis. The extra over cost of face bricks is 4,000 rand per thousand bricks, multiplied by 52 bricks per square meter, which equals 208 rand per square meter. We can add 2.5% application waste. The extra over labor constant for an artisan is 0.30 hour, plus 0.26 hours per square meter for pointing and joining. Lastly, we add the cost for 1.5 general laborers. This gives us a total cost of 278 rand and 25 cents per square meter for the extra over cost of face brick work. Importing the sketch from the previous presentation on brickwork takeoffs, we can quickly calculate the brickwork area required. The brickwork centerline can be calculated using the external wall's perimeter, less 4 by 2 by half the wall thickness which equals 42.64 meters, multiplied by a height of 2.96 meters, less the adjustments for door and window openings, equals 121.444 square meters, which we can round up to 122 square meters. Using the quantity and rates we have calculated previously, we can now calculate the cost of the additional building. The cost of brick work per square meter is 474 rand and 87 cents per square meter plus 278 rand and 25 cents per square meter for the extra over cost for face brick work. We multiply this by the total brick work area of 122 square meters. Therefore the total cost of brick work for the additional structure is 91,880 rand and 64 cents. And that concludes Quantify's presentation on brick work cost analyses. Thank you for watching. Be sure to watch our other videos on the basics of brick work and various other topics in the built environment.